Welcome to Religions of the World. Sikhism, the religion of Sikhs. Sikhs follow a religion that was started in India over 500 years ago by a man called Guru Nanak. He taught that everyone could find God in their own lives. Guru Nanak traveled far and wide. He visited many places and met many people, spreading messages of kindness and peace. The Guru's teachings are all collected in the Sikh holy scriptures, the Guru Granth Sahib. Guru Nanak features in many Sikh stories. One of the most famous stories is the Sikh story of the milk and the jasmine flower. While traveling through India, Guru Nanak arrived at a city with his good friend Mardana. The holy men of the city had promised to be good, but had been greedy and unkind to the people in the city. They were frightened by the Guru's kindness, and they didn't want him to come into their city. They sent a messenger carrying a bowl full of milk to greet the Guru. The bowl of milk is full, said the messenger, just like the city. There is no room for you or your friend. Guru Nanak picked a jasmine flower and gently floated it on top of the milk in the bowl. Not a drop of milk spilt, showing that there was more room in the bowl. There is always room in the world for more holiness, said Guru Nanak. The holy people of the city realized they were wrong and welcomed Guru Nanak and his friend into the city. Another story about Guru Nanak and his teaching is the Sikh story of Duni Chand and the Silver Needle. Guru Nanak arrived at another city and he was welcomed in by the people. A very rich man named Duni Chand held a feast in honor of Guru Nanak. Welcome. Once everyone had eaten, Duni Chand said, I am the richest man in the city. I can and will do anything you ask of me, Guru Nanak. The Guru smiled and gave Duni Chand a thin silver needle from his turban. He said, Keep this safe for me. When I die, we will meet in the next world. Then you can give the needle back to me. Duni Chand was very honored and told his wife what had happened. His wife laughed at him. <laughs> she said, It is impossible to do that. You can't take anything with you when you die. Ah. Soon after, Duni Chand asked the Guru, How am I supposed to carry out this task? The Guru smiled and asked him, if you can't even take the tiny needle with you to the next world, how will you be able to take all your money and belongings? Suddenly, Duni Chand understood. All his golden riches would be useless when he died. The Guru had taught him that only good deeds go with us to the next world, not money and gold. Duni Chand realized that he could change his life. He started to use his money and jewels to help people. He used his great riches and gold to feed hungry people Thank and help you. poor people for the rest of his days.